So ninth experiment is uh, build a virtual instrument that simulates heating and cooling system. The system must be able to control manually or automatically. So open the LabVIEW tool. So you have to pick one thermometer and uh, one uh, boolean push button to control manually or automatically. So these two buttons to turn on AC and uh, heater. So three indicators. So let us start now. Control N and Control T. So right click, boolean push button so this you can name it as manual then boolean button this is cooler ac heater and here also indicators AC yeah. one more to indicate whether uh, manual, manual mode or automatic mode. Place one thermometer also. It is available in numeric thermometer. You can uh, adjust the height. Now, uh, actually, Manual or uh, automatic is there for that. Uh, we need to select case statement. Select case statement. So, if it is true, manual is true, means uh, you have to control using manual only. So, for this. So in the manual, connect uh, heater to heater. AC to AC, data to data, and this should be connected to here, and this should be connected to uh, Boolean true constant. So this is what true. So this is the case for if it is manually is turned on, then manually you have to turn down the AC and manually you have to turn on the heater. And uh, this manual is connected to true, boolean true you have to select. Next in the false, uh, you have to place uh, thermometer and uh, we need to connect like this, I show the diagram. We need to connect to thermometer. It should be compared with the 
if it is less than 20, then uh, uh, heater should be turned on. If it is greater than 40, this should be turned on. So now, go to my program. Now, I will select comparison. If it is less than less than or equal to or less than anyone you can select, then heaters will be turned on. And if it is greater than 40 or 30, we can come on AC. This uh, can convert this one to data. Change to control. Right? This is very, very important. Actually, this arrow mark was here. So we have to change it to change it to control. So now you can connect this one to here. Thermometer value is uh, connected to one of the input of this. And here create constant and this value. Or you can create numeric constant here also. Is there. So, yes, you know, uh, if it is less than, uh, if it is um, above 30 degree or 35 degree, so then only you can turn on this AC. Similarly, another. Here also numeric constant. So heater, when the heater should be turned on, if it is less than 20 or less than 20 to anywhere, any we can select. Okay. Then you can connect it. And this manual should be actually, see still this run button is not some broken list error is there. Missing other internal value. So here create boolean constant. This is actually false. So now this is uh, corrected and continuously there is enabled now. So I will explain once again. So we can control manually. We can turn on AC or heater. If it is a manual mode, we can turn on air cooler or heater manually. That is if it is true. If it is false, then it is automatic control. So whenever the temperature thermometer temperature goes below, in the automatic, actually the temperature if it is go below 20, then heater should turn on. If it is crosses 30 or 35 degree, AC should turn on. That is automatic, manual LC. Now let us verify output, run continuously. Okay, now actually it is in automatic. So let me check first manual. Now it, manual is actually off now, we can see here. So now it is actually automatic mode. In the automatic mode, since the temperature is Mm, now it is actually more than 35, so AC is on. 
So AC is on, cooler is on. Okay. So as the cooler is on, now temperature is actually reducing, and it goes below twenty means immediately heater should turn on. See heater is turned on. Again, once it crosses thirty five, AC is turned on. This is automatic control. So if it is manual, now I will sell manual. So now you can see. Whenever it is manual, now see here there is no changes in automatic. Automatically, heater and AC both are actually no control. So in the manual mode, if you want to turn on the AC, then you have to click AC button. Turn off AC. Turn on AC. This is manual and heater also. No control over this. And when you turn off this manual automatic mode, now you can see whenever it uh, whenever the temperature is less than twenty, heater is turned down. Whenever it is AC turned down, now no control over this. Even if I turn on, so now this AC nothing is changing. Okay, it's not affecting. It is affecting because of this automatically it is checking the thermometer uh, temperature and it is turning on and off but when you click this manual manually we can turn on heater manually we can turn on ac both i can simultaneously on because it is a manual okay thank you